If you're seeing this blue screen error on your Windows 10 PC, that means there is a problem. And in the video for today, I'm going to give you a solution to this problem. So you need to watch my video completely till the end. So a few days back, I was in a very important meeting using my laptop. But from nowhere, all of a sudden, a blue screen pops up on the screen telling me your PC ran into a problem and needs to restart, we'll restart for you. This error at that point of time was a big issue because I was doing a very important presentation to my client and I couldn't do it. I had to wait for like two to seven minutes and only then I had to, you know, do the presentation again. Now, this has happened to me not for the first time. In the past twice or thrice, it has already happened. And whenever you are doing something very important, only then this error comes, okay? And it shuts down your PC. I mean, you have to let go of your work. If your work is not saved, gone. Your work is gone. So what I decided was to get to the service center for my PC and fix this once and for all. So they fixed the error. And they also gave me a clear explanation as to why this may have happened. And they also gave me some suggestions that I have utilized and I have fixed this till now. It's been like over a week. I'm not having any kind of a problem anymore. So in order for you to fix this, you need to ensure just two important things. The first thing is you should have enough of battery backup while you're performing this. And uh, the second thing is your laptop should be connected to the internet. That's it. So the next thing for you to do is get back to your desktop and you do a search for command prompt, C-O-M-M-A-N-D, command prompt, very simple. Do a right click out here, run as administrator, select that option and select yes. If you get a pop-up like this, then you get the command prompt open up. Here, you need to type in a prompt that I'm gonna show you, SFC, forward slash scan now hit the enter button of your laptop now this is going to scan your entire computer for crash reports errors any outdated drivers or whatever it is it's going to get automatically fixed by your windows laptop and your laptop may or may not restart by itself it depends from brand to brand but if your laptop doesn't restart i want you to go ahead and do a hard restart and then the next time you use your pc you are not going to see that error anymore if in the future you see the error again what I suggest you to do is get to your support center for your laptop brand and ask them to help you with that problem. I hope this helps and I hope you got some value. If you did, give my video a thumbs up, subscribe and hit the bell notification icon. Take care, my friend.